Hi, I'm Anne. I'm here with Molly. She's just got into her dream publication. Molly, tell us a bit more about that. Uh, hi, I'm Molly and I just got a link in Forbes. Uh, it is a 94DR, so I am so excited about the amazing coverage for our client. Amazing. So, how long have you dreamt about getting featured in Forbes? Well, uh, in November of last year, our media team asked us what our dream publications were, and mine was Forbes. So it's taken me four months now to get in, and uh, yeah, super pleased. So you and Forbes, you in contact now, best friends? Yeah, so Tracy is a uh, contributing writer at Forbes, and she reached out and wanted to cover our piece, and she's been so kind and um, great correspondence. She's even posted it on LinkedIn and mentioned me, so yeah, she's been great. Amazing, and do you think that relationship will continue further in the future with more PR material coming from you? Yeah, I hope so. Um, she mainly writes about happiness and, th and lifestyle, so I think that's such a positive thing that I'd um, like to write more about, really. So hopefully I can reach out to her and she'll cover that in the future. Amazing. Tell us a bit more about the campaign that got you into Forbes. Uh, so the campaign was to determine the happiest states in the US, and how we did this was using the OECD Better Life Index which is an index that determines different factors that people um, value for their well-being. Okay. So I ranked those, well, the index ranks those for you, and then I took those factors such as like health, education, things like that, and applied those to statistics in each of the states in the US. And it turns out that North Dakota is the happiest state in the US, if you're planning on moving there. And don't move to Kentucky because they're the saddest. <laughs> okay. Tell us a bit more about how you went to distribute that press release. Um, so the I found the data actually quite a challenge because it was such a big data set. Um, but with the help of our head of PR, Andrew, he uh, kindly helped me um, sort it all out and then I wrote it up in a press release and distributed it to loads and loads of journalists um, because we needed to do it regionally for every state in the US. Uh, we also sent it to UK Press just in case they were interested in that. It's also got some great links and placements on loads of other sites. It's also on MSN, which I'm really pleased about. Um, last Thursday, Tracy said that she was going to publish it on Forbes, but she was going to post it on the Sunday edition. So I was patiently waiting all weekend, <laughs> refreshing the page and telling my parents about it all the time. And then luckily I got to see it this morning, so I was so happy coming into work. Congratulations for getting a new dream publication. Thank you very much. I need a new dream publication now.